guys welcome back to my channel plant lovers i hope you loved the last video today i'll be talking about anthurium flower it has a very beautiful structure of the roots and the leaves and the flower it is also known as the tail flower because of this structure and it is also known as the painter's palette now i'll be saying about some facts about these so it is a plant of genus of thousand species of flowering plants it comes in variety of colors we have a red color it is it came from the family called andreae so this plant should be kept in a well lit place but do not expose it to direct sunlight as we kept in this place where there is no direct sunlight now the watering structure now what we need to do is once a week what you need to do is add some ice cubes to this so that it can grow very beautifully the next thing is that do not overwater it that it can spoil the root system as you can see it has a very delicate root system next thing is that if you live in a hot area then water it 2 to 3 days and let the soil be dry when it's it's in a growing period from march to september then leave the soil moist as we have left it uh, now next thing uh, why do leaves turn brown like this it's a little bit brown because of the over uh, exposed to sunlight over watering or nutrient deficiency so if it is a nutrient deficiency then it will turn whole black if it's this much then it is over watering or exposed to direct sunlight if it is a vitamin def uh, deficiency then what you need to do is buy a npk fertilizer that is called also a p fertilizer example rock phosphate and acidic phosphate now i will be saying three mistakes that all of us do even me and you now the first thing is over watering so if we should not over water any time or else the root starts rotting and the plant can die so we don't want our plant to die right yes so the next thing is failing to repot here there's no problem in here and the drainage uh, holes are down so we check every week that the roots doesn't come out of the drainage plants or else it will stunt the growth and it will die The next thing is low temperature or humidity as this is a tropical plant as this is a tropical plant it needs about uh, 70 degrees of uh, humidity so you can have a humidifier so which makes your plant grow very beautifully now if you like this video if you like this video subscribe to our channel and until the next video Stay safe, stay home, keep planting and thank you.